I don't want to brag as well. I think I, I might be like a character in a few people's cruise ship story. Like, I, the baby was not loving the buffet because there's a lot of people and they're not always well-mannered. So, like, past the first day, I would get on the elevator, go up to the buffet, grab, like, all the food for the whole family, and then take it down in the elevator so we could eat it in our room, okay? So, like, day four, I had a few hash browns, a bunch of bacon, chocolate chip muffins, croissants, Mickey Mouse waffles and stuff like that. I get in the elevator, goes down one floor, dad and his family get on. He says, wow, that breakfast looks good. I said, it's for uh, another adult and a baby. He says, no problem. I've had a few breakfasts like that myself. So even if there wasn't a baby, it's okay. I said, that's good because I made up the stuff about the baby. And then I swear, I've never, they, they, it's a, like a warm audience, right? Everyone on the cruise is already having fun. So they're ready to laugh. And uh, they, they were cracking up. I'm sure they, they probably told that story again like two times. They're like, remember that guy on the elevator today? Oh, man. And then when uh, we did this like photo thing where our baby could get her photo taken with all these like Disney princesses. And I was doing, uh, Kate was in the photo because I was wearing uh, a shirt that said catch a can salmon capital of the world because I ran out of laundry so I didn't want to <laughs> be in the photo well no she didn't want me to be in the photo um because she was dressed nicely anyway so I was doing the videography right and while I was filming it on Kate's camera I said you know we've been on this cruise for six days so I'm really hoping she's a bit better behaved in these photos but enough about my wife I hope the baby does well too and the, the woman who was taking the photos started laughing and I said, do you like that one? And she said, yeah, that was pretty good. You got a chuckle out of me. I was like, well, what can I say? Okay, Kate and Luna are taking some photos with the Disney princesses. Hoping she's a bit better behaved for these photos. It's been uh, six days, seven days. But enough about Kate. I'm sure the baby will be fine. Okay. That's a little joke I had rehearsed for the start of this. <laughs> It's a good one? Yeah, okay. <laughs> I, I, gotta, I was kind of on, man. And also, I was blending in with Americans so well. Like one day, this is another a buffet elevator story. It was the first day we were in Alaska. I was on the elevator. And then an older guy got in right after me. And he said, what's the temperature today? They said low 50s, and I said, it's going to get as low as 47. And he went like, wow, that's cold. I was like, I don't know what the fuck 47 means. But he thought I was, even though I wasn't wearing a University of Miami at Ohio uh, sweatshirt, he, he thought I was one of them. He, I'm an honorary American now. 47 is almost freezing. I know, I'm familiar with 32, okay? I, I gotta say, I was kinda, I'm not saying I was the star of the cruise, but I was kinda cracking it up. I'm sure the staff probably appreciated that I was like one of the only adults on the ship who wasn't singing every time they recognized a song, which was every three seconds, because all of the songs they play are the most recognizable Disney songs of all time. So they're probably like, at least this guy brought some original material, holy cow. What did the baby think of the drawing dinner? Yo, we got a, a certified Disney uh, cabana vacation member here. So one of the dinners, you draw a self-portrait, and then they put it into some kind of scanner, I'll and then they you. show, oh, they drawing. animate the it drawing. on a big screen in the middle oh of the, God. well, on the edges of the restaurant for everybody. It was cool. <laughs> uh, how did she like it? She liked it about the same as all the other dinners, which is to say, um, she liked it as long as there was like unlimited chocolate milk on the at the table. Why so many old people? Dude, I, honestly, I'm not knocking the, the old people. I think it's just pleasant. Like if you're already the kind of person that would like go t on a trip and then like when you got to the hotel, you would only leave the hotel to like do one museum tour and then eat dinner. That's basically what it is. Like you're, you're just laying in bed for like half an hour. Then you go eat like some uh, breakfast. Then you go like, I don't know, uh, watch like a, a 45 minute long family friendly stage show. Then you go eat lunch at a buffet, I might add, at a buffet. And then you like, you know, go take a little 90 minute duck boat tour of Ketchikan, Alaska, go eat dinner and then go to bed. It's just, it's 
It's just eating and uh, and swaying. 